What's going on guys, it's Adonis, and today I'm gonna to show you how to import your iPhone photos into Windows 10 without using iCloud. All right guys, let's get into it. So before we get started, I do wanna put a disclaimer out there. This video is not about using iCloud with Windows. I will be doing a separate video on that, but this is actually for somebody that wants to move their photos from their iPhone to their Windows PC without using iCloud. And the reason why is iCloud does keep your devices in sync, but at the same time, if you delete those photos off of your computer, it will delete them off of your phone as well. So this is, like I said before, a video for that person that wants to offload their photos onto their computer to free up more space on their phone. All right, guys, let's get started. So before we get started, if this is the first time you're connecting your iPhone to your Windows PC, a couple of things are gonna need to be done. First thing, your phone will ask you to trust or not trust the computer. You need to select trust. And also on the Windows PC, depending on the version of Windows, it may ask you for a install of a driver for your iPhone. You're just gonna wanna follow the directions for that. So first thing you're gonna wanna do is connect the phone to the computer. I'm running Windows 10, and in Windows 10, the Photos app is already pre-installed. So when you connect it, you'll see the Photos app automatically open up and start to calculate how many photos that you have on your phone that need to be imported. Now keep in mind, if you don't wanna select all photos to be imported and you just want selected photos, you do have to select the clear all button next to the month of photos that you're importing. Now, it does sound a little bit annoying, but you have to do that for each month of photos to unselect them, and then you can go back and select individual photos. Now, once you've selected those photos and you're about to import, there is a little checkbox that you can select that will delete the photo off of your phone after it's been successfully imported into your computer. And that is it, and it will organize them by import, by month, and you have folders that you can create inside of the Photos app. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys liked this video and found it helpful, go ahead and hit that like button and show me some love. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, you're gonna wanna do that. Hit that APP logo in the corner to subscribe to the channel, or if you're on mobile, hit the subscribe button. All right guys, till next time, see you later. Thanks again for watching guys. If you guys like this video and wanna see more content like this, go ahead and click that APP logo in the corner to subscribe to the channel. Also, if you guys wanna chat with me on social media, go ahead and like my Facebook page, Absolutely Tech, and follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Adonis underscore ATMLV. All right, guys, till next time. See you later.